Hey guys, it's Hester here, and today we are going to be watching this tutorial about how to make a server message. Hope you enjoy the video. And here are the chips that we'll be needing for today's tutorial. Alright, using all the chips you got, we're going to start doing some editing. First thing we're going to edit is the event definition. You can name it to whatever you want, but for right now, I named it to server message. Using the add new property feature, we're going to go to type, search, or look for player. And you can set it to whatever, but I'm going to set it to who activated, as it's way easier to tell. Add that property. Then, we're going to search or look for the string type. And then we're going to set the string type to message, or whatever you want. Then, once we do that, we're going to go to the string format, and add one more input. Then, we're going to set our event sender to all and set it to our event definition. We're gonna do the same and we're gonna set our event receiver to server message. Then once all that's done, you can set the prompt title to whatever you want, but for right now, I'll not be setting it to anything. Then you wanna use your connect tab and you wanna start doing some things. You wanna wire the press to the prompt local player. Then you want to do complete, wire that to the event sender, set who activated to get local player, and set the message to the response. Then, the event receiver, you want to actually set that to activate the player sub subtitle. The who activated will go to the value of two string, and the result will go to the middle, will go to the top val value, and then the message will go in the other value. Then, you want to configure, open the format, and then you want to set your format to this. Weird bracket, zero, weird bracket, colon, then, weird bracket, one, weird bracket. Once it's set to that, then, you want to set the result to the subtitle, then, after that, you're done. And that's how you make a server message. You're completely done. So all we can do, all we have to do, is click the button, prompt whatever you want, and it will come up, and it will show to everyone. Have a good day.